There is a huge feeling of anger and frustration, in fact, disgust at what goes on here in Washington. We're in big trouble. And the reason we're in big trouble is because things don't work. What happens is that people don't talk to each other. They talk at each other. Scott, you don't love America. You don't love the Constitution. These last couple of years are the are the worst and the nastiest and the meanest that I can remember in the 41 years I've been in Washington. There's no trust in Washington. All we have is a partisanship problem. You have people who get elected. They're thinking uppermost at first, you know, how does this affect my political party? If you want your news delivered from a conservative point of view, you can get it delivered from a conservative point of view. If you want a liberal view, you can find somebody to give it to you that way. But the result of that is we no longer all have the same database. And they make millions off of green pea people who listen to their crap. The Supreme Court of the United States making a decision that a corporation is like a person to give money even now anonymously to get into campaign? Madness. You can run any kind of ad you want under any kind of patriotic name you want and no one knows who's paid for that ad. If there's a place where money is gonna corrupt campaigns, Citizens United decision did it. I don't really care what people think or do anything, it's just if they can talk about it. I think not only can we do it, not only do we have to do it, but people need to start setting an example. I do think citizens need to be much more engaged. You have to be informed. We are the mainstream of America. We represent the sensible center and the majority in the middle. If we leave this to the activists on the right or even on the left alone, then we're going to have more of the same. Patriocracy.